go. So let me see. I'm going to go ahead and don't, you guys don't get up. I'll mute everybody here. Oh, except for now you all are muting yourselves. So you can, let's see. Do you? All right. And Dickie. Are you muting me? Yeah, I guess I'll, I'll mute you. But it's not letting me. I'll do it. Oh, wait, no, I got it. We're good. Okay, here we go. So let's begin, vamos a empezar. You're gonna start um, sitting up just a bit on your mat and we'll just face the computer. And take a moment to just sit tall. So if you need to open your hips to kind of relax that letting the knees externally rotate, you could even take your hands here to the thighs for a moment and just encourage a little bit of length in your back as your hips release. So if this part of you feels really tight, you can make some adjustments in your legs. Good. And then feel your weight. So from your hips, come right underneath the ribs, right underneath the shoulders, right? So just know many of us spend a lot of time sitting back or pitching our weight forward. See if you can find that happy medium for a moment, just as we're sitting here. Good. All right, so once you're there, Walk your fingertips to your rib cage. And let's take five breaths right here. So you're gonna inhale, move the air out, letting the rib cage expand, and then exhale, knit the ribs together to just feel your obliques and also your intercostal muscles and also your transverse. So these muscles help you maintain that long, a long spine. Exhale. Inhale, letting your ribs, fingertips expand, and then exhale, pulling right back in. One more time, inhale, and then exhale. So now from here, walking your fingertips up, pull your collarbones wide, good. And feel, so as I lift my elbows and pull them slightly back, the scapula actually pulls onto your, onto your spine, moves a little more vertically. Take a second to just check your shoulders. Take them the other way. Good, take your ear towards one side, ear to the other side, just checking the mobility in your neck, chin up, chin down, very nice. And then from here, let's take your arms, you're gonna exhale round, moving your spine forward. And then we're gonna sweep and stack ourselves up nice and tall. Inhale, take a breath, exhale, moving forward, and then really undulate through the back, Stacking yourself right back up nice and tall. One more time, inhale. And exhale, rounding forward, creating a deep scoop. So those belly muscles engage. Very nice. Take a second. Palms roll up. Palms roll down. Palms roll up. Just checking with your shoulders. Keep a little softness there. And from there with your palms up, keep the elbows soft. Rotate your ribs to the right. Inhale as you move through the center, rotate your ribs to the left. So ground and anchor your weight on your sitting bones while you twist. A la derecha, a la izquierda. Good, take that one more time, each side, and exhale activates your obliques. Good, let your palms come up for a moment, just right over your head. Press the hands into one another. Good, and then from here, Exhale, twist and lengthen. So the arms will come down over the head. Exhale, twist and reach. Inhale through your center. Exhale, twist, still feeling your spine elongate as you twist. Very nice, let's go. Cada dirección, each direction, one more time. Beautiful, so now sweep one arm underneath you, one arm overhead. Reach through the fingertips. Inhale, stacking up. Exhale, reach in the opposite direction. A lot of energy through your arms. Good, inhale, exhale, sweep and reach. So moving the spine, beautiful. One more time, inhale and exhale. Good, so now take your two arms up once again and then you're gonna sweep all the way around, feeling your torso move just as one thing. Right. Let's go ahead and now change the direction, making sure your hands aren't falling forward, but you're still keeping some reach in the arms as you come around. Beautiful, pause, open the arms, 
unfold the legs just a moment. You're gonna exhale, reach towards one leg, stack it right back up. Exhale, reach towards the opposite leg, stack it up, reach, creating a twist from your center. Inhale up, exhale, twist and reach. Inhale up, exhale, twist and reach. Inhale up, one more time, exhale, twist and reach. Let's pause. I'm gonna now turn my side here to face the um, computer screen. And then we're gonna start moving our way down to the mat. So my sits bones here on the edge of my blanket. So I'm gonna inhale, stretch, reach forward now. Let the low back move to the thighs. Exhale, sit tall, take another breath. Exhale, float back and pulse five, four and three and two and one. Good, rotate to your right, stretch, reach up on that side. Exhale, pull down, and now pulse five, four, and three, and two, and one. Inhale, move through your center. Exhale, twist to the left. Come up, long stretch of your back. Exhale, pulling down, and pulse five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, sweeping the arms up, and exhale, floating down to the opposite side. Inhaling up. Exhale, coming to the opposite side. Inhale up. Still feeling your weight should stay even in your sitting bones throughout this whole movement. Good. Inhale up. Exhale to the right last time. Inhale up and exhale to the left. Good. Open the legs, open the arms. You're going to twist to the left and then reach back. Five and four and three and two. And one, inhale, stack the spine, coming up tall, take a twist to the right, reaching back and pulsing lightly. Five, four, and three, and two, and one. Inhale, coming up, closing the legs, palms underneath you, taking some weight back. Lift the two legs, take them down and up. Five, and four, and three, and two, and one, good pause, left leg out, down and up, five, four, three, two, one, right back in, right leg out, down and up, five, four, three, two, one, bending both knees, feet to the floor, turn the fingertips out, exhale, lift the pelvis up to three, come right down to three, take a stretch forward, Push through the hands, push through the feet, lift the pelvis up. Exhale, set it down gently. Once the sits bones arrive at the floor, take your sternum, stretch it forward. Good, this time don't drop your head. Sweep the arms, palms are facing in towards the body. Five, four, so again, you're still waking up your scapula. Two and one, good. Arms still floating wide, now come down. Sternum right above your knees, open the arms, five, open the arms, four, opening three, and two, and one. Good, pause, lower the ribs a hair more, fingertips on the right hand, reaching down, changing sides, and we'll go five, and four, and three, and two, and one. One, very nice, two arms out. We're gonna lower to the mat on a five. On a four, reach to the fingertips, reach to the toes. Three, two, one. Take a breath down here, your arms are overhead. Push your feet, tap them into the floor. Pull the belly in. And just wake yourself up on this plane. Good, push both feet into the floor. Exhale, lift your knees. Stay right over your ankles, right over your heels. Arms float up. Exhale, we lift five. Inhale, coming down. Taking that again. Really articulating each vertebra. Good. A couple more. Good. Just watching your back move down and up from the floor, feeling the glutes and the hamstrings connected. Beautiful. We're gonna pause up here for just a moment, press the elbows in, and again, create a nice little light pulse of the pelvis, down and up, 10 and nine, eight, seven, six, letting the hamstrings really, really do the heavy lifting. Also from the glutes, two 
and one. Let's exhale, lightly set those bones down. Arms float to a Y shape alongside the ear. Five little circles of the arms. Good, just feeling that, that connection in your chest. Wake up, take it the other way. Beautiful. Exhale, interlace the fingers behind the head. Move the hands there, inhale. Exhale, pull down with the belly, down with your tailbone. Let the head come all the way up. Light little pulse to let the scapula come from the floor. Take another five and four and three and two and one. Let's rotate the ribs to the left. Same thing, really feel the scapula lifting from the floor. Feel your obliques deeply engaged in this lift, two and one. Inhale, move, and exhale. Take it to the opposite side. Remember, as I twist to my right, I'm going to pull my left hip bone down to create that balance in my pelvis. Two and one. Inhale, back to the center. Lower your head for just a moment. Take your two feet up. Right leg stretches out, up, down, and in. Left leg goes out and up, down, and in. Take a breath. Lift the head and chest, right leg goes out, up, down, and in, left leg out, up, down, and in, good pause. From here again, re-scoop your shoulder blades up from the floor, light pulse, five, four, three, two, one, to the right, pulsing, five, four, three, two, one, to the left, pulsing, five, four, Three, two, one, very nice. Back here through your center, right leg out and up, down and in, left leg out and up, down and in, pause. Knees over the chest, lower the head and chest. Here we go. Exhale, lift the head and chest, stretch the two legs out and up, down and in, release. Three more, inhale. And now exhale, lift the head and chest as you extend the legs out. Now up, now down, and in. Good, take a breath, inhale. Exhale, lifting, stretching out, and up. Now down, and in. Good, two more, inhale. Exhale, lifting out, and up, down, and in. Good, last time, out, and up. Hold the up, hands behind the thighs, lift yourself a hair higher. Hundreds, you'll inhale two, three, four, five, exhale two, three, four, five, inhale two, three, four, five, exhale two, three, four, five, inhale two, three, four, five, exhale two, three, four, five. Hands between the inner thighs, heels together, toes apart, slightly lower the legs. Inhale two, three, four, five, exhale two, three, four, five, inhale two, three, four, five, exhale two, three, four, five, inhale two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, five, little pause, hands to the inner thighs again, so if you lower the legs a hair more, drive the belly deep, lift your scapula up, inhale, two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, five, inhale, two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, five, last time, two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, five, pause, bend the knees, feet to the floor, lower your head and chest, Head to each side, making sure you create release in your neck. Good, and then from here, exhale, pull and lift the pelvis up. Take a breath, the left leg lifts, it taps down and up. Good, so you're gonna steady your hips as that leg floats in the air. Good, if for whatever reason it's too much for you right now, just leave the pelvis on the floor. Beautiful, couple more. And then you're gonna exhale, lift the opposite side, down and up, just waking up this hip, feeling firmness on the opposite side of your fingertips reaching. Good, now exhale, you're gonna switch. One leg, then the other, so catch the weight, lifting the pelvis, exhale, take this down and up, down and up, down, and up, down, and up. Steady in the pelvis, waking up the glutes. Beautiful, now exhale and extend 
and reach. So bend, extend, reach, bend, extend, reach, control the movement the whole way up, the whole way down. So, you know, think, think um, retired Rockette, lots of control here as you reach up from the floor. Good. I mean, you could just take it across your body and just create a little nice IT band. Stretch as you go. It's waking up your glutes. Good. Energy through your knees and legs. Beautiful. Take a pause. Lift the pelvis one more time. Slowly exhale. Bring that right back down. Fingertips move back behind the head. Inhale. And exhale. Open your knees. And exhale, lift the head and chest. Now stretch your right leg up and out on the diagonal and then you're gonna circle it there. Good. So keep hips, shoulders steady and stable, legs circled, changes direction. Good. Exhale, toes pull right back together, head lowers, take a breath. When you come down, try pushing your head into your hands and lifting your scapula off of the floor just to create a little, almost this is in yoga, this would be called like a version of Matsasana, but it's just a nice way to remind your back to kind of move the other way after a lot of rounding. So here we go. Exhale, lift the head and chest, and then exhale, sweep that leg, left leg out to the side, create circles here, three and two, and one other way, five, four, three, two, and one, good. Exhale, bring your leg back together. Knees can float up. Take another breath. Pull the heels together. Now you're gonna exhale, lift the head and chest up. Cross the right leg in front of the left. And then you're gonna change this cross. Five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Now lift the scapula, lower the legs, just a hair. Take five, four, three, two, one, very nice. Lift the scapula, lower the leg. Five, four, three, two, one. Go ahead, bend the knees. Bring your feet to the floor. I've got my right leg crossed in front of my left. I'm gonna take my two arms right back down to my sides. Good, so just check that in your feet for a moment. You can do that little tapping exercise with your ankles crossed. Good. And then pushing your feet down. Squeeze the knees, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Hold the squeeze, lift the sits, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Tap the heels, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Tap them the other way, balls of the feet, 5, 4, Three, two, one, roll balls to heels, five, and four, and three, and two, and one. Exhale, lift the pelvis one more time. Lower right back down, lift the two legs. Change the cross of the two legs. Set those feet slowly back on the floor. Tap, 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 waking up. So when you tap the feet, you should feel this all the way into the belly. Good. Now from here, you're gonna evenly push your feet into the floor. Exhale, lift the pelvis. Knee squeeze for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, now sitting bones. Hold the squeeze and lift the sits for 10, nine, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, one, tap the heels. Five, four, three, two, one, balls of the feet. Five, four, three, two, one, balls to heels. Five, and four, and three, and two, and one. Lift the hips and pelvis. Slowly set those bones down. Extend the two legs up. Good. Now from here, you've got your left leg crossed over the right. Take a little stretch. Let the Legs come back toward you and back up. Change the cross. Legs come toward you and right back up. Change the cross. Fold the ankles. 
Hands to the ankles. Can you sit up? Whoa. We're doing a half crab. Good. So now you're going to roll back to the floor. Hold. Change the cross. And come right back up. All right. You want to try it again? So you roll back. You hold. You change the cross. Feel that in the belly. You exhale and come up. Good. All right. Uncross the legs, extend the legs. Let's go for some roll ups. So, arms coming out. Remember, ways to modify your roll ups are to put weights in your hands, um, roll up your blanket, or give yourself a prop back behind you. Do what you need. Inhale and exhale, or push your feet out into the wall in front of you. That can also be really helpful. Now, we're going to exhale, create extension as we lower five, four, three, two, and one, inhale the arms alongside the ears. Exhale, arms coming up, lift the head, the chest, the shoulder blades, the rib cage, lumbar, sacrum. We're up, heels together, toes apart, pinkies together, palms stretching out. Inhale and exhale. Let's lower five, four, three, two, one, now pause down here, interlace the fingers, the hands can move behind the head. Once again, let the scapula lift off of the floor as you hold here. Five, four, three, two, one. Set that down, raise your right foot on that little diagonal circle, tiny little circle very close to the floor. Change the direction. Beautiful. Left foot lifts an inch, tiny little circle very close to the floor. Change the direction. Good. Inhale, pull the belly deep, lift the two legs. Hold them 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Release. Exhale, lift the head and chest. Lift the two legs, beat the heels. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, one, release. The head comes down, take a breath. The fingertips pull together. Palms reach out, inhale, heels together, toes apart. Exhale, rising up. Five, four, three, two, one. Take a big stretch forward. Keep the palms facing up, sweep the arms out to your side. Beautiful. Take them the other way. Excellent. So now bring your palms, let them touch. Right leg pulls over the left. Sweep, come forward. Good. Stack the spine tall. Take a twist towards that right leg. Sweep, come over, stretch your back. Feel also your IT band stretch here. Inhale, coming up. Exhale, sweeping to the left. And now inhale, coming up. Good. Let's exhale, bring ourselves back. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Arms alongside the ears. You can hold them here for a moment. Now, if you like, again, everything's optional. Try lifting the legs. Hold them above the floor for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, one. Release. Big breath. Arms over the belly. Reach through the fingertips. Reach through the toes. The palms pull together, but the collarbones pull apart. Good. Take your hands underneath you. Try this real quick. You'll soften the knees. Just with your knees bent, I want you to take three little circles one way and three little circles in the opposite direction. Good, pause, change the cross, sweep the legs out. Uh, take your two arms up here for just a moment and the palms will come together. You'll inhale, rise up, twist to the left, stretch, reach over the legs. Good, so just notice in this cross-legged position, you're gonna get a different stretch in your legs. Inhale, coming up, and exhale, sweeping over opposite side. Good, and then we're gonna inhale, come up, 
and then exhale slowly roll down to the floor five four three two one fingertips up collarbones open belly pulling deep and strong lift the legs ten nine eight seven six five four three two one release arms here out in front lift and reach so extend 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 as you find that c curve in your belly good inhale arms up exhale this time bend the knees but maybe lift them a hair higher make your circle a hair smaller circle of three two one circle the other way three two and one good let's unfold the legs push some weight in your hands through into the feet good take a breath push and lift excellent so now coming off of the fingertips for just a moment stretch your right oh left leg up and then exhale lift the pelvis up five four three two one set it down lift the leg five four three two one set it down lift the pelvis take it down and up five four and three and two and one beautiful hold bend the knee release opposite leg stretches out so first thing you'll do everybody make sure you continue to take your weight off of your hands put blood flow in there through the wrist through the forearm through the elbow and then exhale hands move back down to the floor you're going to just begin lifting the pelvis and hold five four three two one excellent release coming down leg lifts five four and three and two and one very nice setting that leg back down exhale push lift the pelvis now the leg five and four and three and two and one good bend the knee press lift come right back down let your fingertips float off of the floor stretch your spine forward good take your two arms out close pull back lift now twist your ribs to the left you can leave your feet on the floor if you need to exhale twist your ribs to the right inhale exhale twist your ribs to the left inhale and exhale twist your ribs to the right good take a moment stretch reach come over the legs good we're gonna do that one more time we're gonna lift our shin bones just a little bit higher this time so palms together shins up twist to the left back to the center twist to the right back to the center twist to the left you could even extend if you wanted to back to the center twist to the right back to the center pause bend the knees rotate towards the computer screen beautiful stack your two legs one on top of the other let the forearm come down to the mat lift your top leg so now you're going to take a little leg swing we're going to bend the knee stretch it out up now back and in stretch it out forward back and in stretch it out forward back and in stretch it out forward back and in good now from here just stretch back lift the leg down and up ten nine eight seven six five you can put this hand behind your head if you like three two one bend the knee with the knee bent circle it slightly in the hip socket five four three two and one very nice good exhale slip the leg behind you and then let your head reach back also so i'm going to lift my rib cage up here and get a big stretch extend through my top arm 
anchor through my bottom leg, sweeping over to that side. Now back, good, sweeping over to that side. And now back, good, sweeping over. Good, now I'm gonna take two arms, fold back, lift this leg, good, sweep it around and take a little stretch. So I've just twisted my torso toward my top leg. And then I'm gonna slide my two legs out, try this little sequence on the other side. Let the forearm come underneath your shoulder, lift the top leg, bend the knee, stretch the leg out, back, down, and in, stretch it out forward, back, and in, stretch it up, forward, back, and in, stretch it out, forward, back, and in, stretch it out, forward, back, and in, last time, out, forward, back, and in. So anyway, just in general for knee function, I think that's a really wonderful exercise on every plane, down and up, 10, 9, and 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, one. Bend the knee, circle the leg. Five, four, three, two, one. Other way. Five, four, three, two, one. Very nice. Keeping that knee bent. Exhale, set it down. Your top hand can move behind you. Lift your rib cage. So I'm getting a stretch through my armpit chest. Good, and then I'm gonna push with the bottom arm, feel myself float up, stretching over. And then exhale, releasing to the opposite side. Now stretching, reaching over. Now coming back towards the opposite side, stretching, reaching over. Good, now two arms, float back. Here you go, lift this leg, sweep it around, and then rotate your rib cage it. Take a twist. Beautiful. And then from here, I'm going to take my two legs to the side. Oh, actually, let's come up on your knees. So come here for a moment and we'll continue to face the computer screen. Sweep the arms out. Exhale, scoop, reach, come forward, undulate the back and lift. Arms out. Scoop, reach, coming forward, undulate the back and lift. Good, one more time, scoop, reaching, coming forward. This time with the fingertips move to the floor, I'm gonna lift my left knee out to the side. Five, exhale, lifting. So mirror me, go opposite, whatever you need to do. Three, two, and one. Good, let's try that on the other side. The leg lifts, five. And four, and three, and two, and one. Good, waking up external rotation. Going back to that original side, now extend the shin bone out. Five, four, and three, and two, and one. Go ahead, set that leg down. Beautiful, reach some weight back, come stretching up. Stretch over the leg. And then exhale, stretch away from the leg. We're gonna come over the leg, catch your obliques right there. And then back, good. This time hold to the side, top arm over the ear. Now exhale, lift the arm and leg for 10 and nine and eight and seven and six and five and four and three, and two, and one. Good, top arm forward, top leg back, change 10, and nine, and eight, and seven, and six, and five, and four, and three. Oh, I'm feeling this too, and one. Good, pause. 
the leg floats back down top, arm reaches over. I want you to take that hand, walk yourself around to the front. Good, so right here, reach your hips back and forward, slide the knee in. Let's get ready to do that sequence on the other side. So here you go, I'm gonna lift my left, my right knee, you go whichever knee you haven't done yet, five, stretching up, four, and three, two, and one. Exhale, set the leg down gently. Reach the foot into the floor. Exhale, take your weight up. Stretching over, now stretching away. Good, get a big, lots of length here through your side. Inhale, coming up, stretching over. Now stretching away. Beautiful, now stretching back over. Good, this time we're gonna hold the away and exhale, the top arm and leg lift together. Down and up, 10 and nine and eight and seven, and six, five, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful, top arm forward, top leg back, change 10, and nine, and eight, and seven, and six, and five, four, and three, two, and one. Go ahead, set that leg down gently with the head and neck release. Beautiful, take your hands, walk them all the way around, back to the front, good. And then from here, just slide the back leg in. Let's turn, I'm going my right side to the computer screen. Walk your fingertips slightly beyond your shoulders. Now reach. Your forearms down to the floor, take your tailbone up. Give yourself just a couple breaths here, moving the thoracic spine in. Beautiful, now exhale, move your forearm, keep your weight there um, and the forearms and then press your, uh, pull the shoulders right over your elbows. And then you're gonna lift your hips. Good, set them right back down, two more. Lift the hips, set them down. Lift, if you can hold this, lift the right leg down and up. Five, four, three, and two, and one. Letting your neck be released all the way down. Now, if you can, circle the leg. Five, four, three, two, one. Other way, five, four, three, two, one, exhale, release, knees move to the floor, sternum stretches down, let your neck go. So in this configuration, the higher you can get your tailbone, the more engaged your shoulders can be, the more your neck can really release. You can let that, almost let the head just dangle there between your two shoulders. All right, so let's exhale, try this sequence on the other side. Push the forearms down deep to the floor, spread the fingertips up. Exhale, lift the hips and pelvis. Now the left leg, just let it come down and up, taking five. It's building some efficiency there in your hamstrings. Three, letting your neck dangle completely. Two, and one. Now hold, circling, five, four, three, two, one other way, five, four, three, two, and one. Good, exhale, release, let that leg come down. Two knees, relax one more time, stretch your neck, or stretch out your chest and shoulders here. Beautiful, now I'm gonna move weight forward. Take my two legs out, so I'm in a little light, um, uh, um, hovering plank and I'm just gonna lift the hips down and up let's go three more down and up two down and up one beautiful now you're gonna rotate towards the computer screen top hand of the hip lift the thighs ten nine eight 
seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, release. Other side, down and up. 10, nine, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Top arm down. Come into a plank just a moment. Lift the hips. Walk your hands back right, left, right. Allow your neck to release completely. Shake it no. Nod it yes. Good. Take your fingertips. So, um, April, Sherry, take your fingertips here to the back of your occiput and roll your head up a little bit. So this is supported, but just let your whole back stretch here. Not just April and Sherry, everyone can do this. Oh, and then we're gonna come all the way into standing. Move your blanket out of the way. Pick up your weights if you'd like. Great. So let's start once again in the center of your mat. <clears throat> and we're going to take your arms here to your sides for a moment. Bring your feet all the way together. And you're going to sweep the arms. So just create a little circle. Push your feet down. So really feel your weight ground. <sighs> it's like you're kind of riding away, removing your arms through the water. Change the direction. Yeah, feeling the center of you, the trunk of your tree really sturdy. Beautiful. So now pause. Let your elbows fold at your sides. Let the hips move back, thighs move back. Good. And then come right back up. Down. And exhale, lift. Down. And exhale, lift. Down. Exhale, lift. Down. Hold down here. Lift the two arms. Just hold down and up. Again, focus on releasing your neck. Elbows in at your sides. Taking three. Taking two. Taking one. Now hold the elbows. Lift and reach the weights back. Five and four, and three, and two, and one. Hold, circle the weights, five, four, three, two, one. Other way, five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful, exhale, weights here in front of you. Heels together, toes apart. So now, arms are gonna reach to the side as you lift one heel, they come back in, opposite heel lifts. Imagine you're gonna keep your hips really sturdy, really steady. One heel lifts and down. One heel lifts and down. One heel lifts and down. So now hold, lift two heels, circle the weights, five, four, three, two, one, circle the other way, five, four, three, two, one, hold the weights, lightly bend the knees, down and up, 10, almost micro pulse, half an inch, nine and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, release, bring it in. Step your two feet wide. Now turn the toes back in. Let your sternum come forward. Everybody hug the scapula onto the back. Sweep the weights. Ten. Sweep them. Nine. Continue to extend the spine. Sweeping out. Eight. Taking them. Seven. Reaching. Six. And five. Good. Bring some weight to the balls of your feet. Good. Three. And two. And one, excellent. Weights come underneath you. Now the arms move up, out, down, and in. Up, now out, 
down and in, up, out, down and in. Change the direction, moving up, out and in, moving, uh -huh. down, out, in. Excellent, pause here in your center. And then let's exhale, turn your toes out. Weights move up, knees move out. Good, weights move up, knees move out, pelvis moves down, tailbone moves down and up, reaching down and up, down, hold the down, forearms, float back five, float back four, three, two, and one, excellent, bringing that in, hold the weights right here in front, right heel, thighs come down and up, five, four, three, two, one, opposite heel, five, four, three, two, one, two heels, five, four, three, two, one, one arm out, five, four, three, two, one, opposite arm, five, four, three, two, one, two arms, five, four, three, two, and one. Exhale, release, turn the toes, let them face in, come all the way down to the floor, set the weights down for a moment and let your back just elongate. Inhale, sweeping up, let's pivot. So now I'm gonna turn toward my right side. This is my left side facing the computer. Beautiful, I'm gonna do a little balance work and then a little stretch. So now put your weight in the front leg, let the back leg lift, hands to your hips, and then lift the back leg down and up. 10, nine, hands on the low back, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, beautiful, leg to the side, down and up, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, leg out in front, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, step the leg in, reach it right back where it was, exhale, slide, Fold over this leg. Again, feel your balance at work in you through your feet, through the ankles, through the knees, through the hips. And then exhale, just slide right up the leg. Pivot, changing side. So begin by letting the back calf get a real stretch. Beautiful, and then from here, you're gonna transfer the weight into your front leg. Good, let that back leg come up. Hands on the low back, keep it steady. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Leg to the side, down and up. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, one. Out in front, down and up. Ten, nine. Ribs in, hips steady. Five, four, three, two, one. Bend the knee, step, reach it back. The arms sweep up, float over the leg. Good, and then from here, pivot, come forward. Good, turn the toes slightly in, release your back once again. Beautiful, from this forward bend, 
um, take opposite hand to ankle and just create a little reach underneath you. Melting into it, opposite hand out, stretch them out towards the other leg. Inhale, you're going to put your weight a little bit in your hands, soften the knees, step the left or right foot to the left, bend the knees, let the pelvis move to the floor. And we're just going to come and take a couple breaths if you wanted to prop your hips or your thighs, anything that will feel good to you. Just come, take a moment. Oh, it's been a long year everybody. Just put your hands here on your abdomen for a moment. Taking a second to appreciate your own work, your own effort. However small that feels sometimes. It takes a lot to be a human being right now. And then when you feel ready, just take your arms up overhead. Give yourself a few breaths here. And then you can roll onto one side, curling in. And then we'll just push up and find ourselves in a seated position. You can bring your palms together, bow the head, close the eyes. Your practice is a gift, everyone. Thank you. Enjoy your day, namaste. Thank you. Thank you. Take care of yourself. <laughs>